Overall, I, I tend to lean towards what the European Society of Cardiology Guidelines recommend, where a preference is given to instented patients uh, to prasugrel or tachagrelor over clopidogrel first. Uh, so in this country, since uh, there's, there's not socialized medicine and affordability is, is an issue or, or, or more or less universal healthcare and affordability is an issue, uh, if a patient can take a twice a day regimen uh, and their insurance will pay for it, I would give preference to utilizing Tachagalor because that's what the question was about initially. Uh, and then if they tolerated the first 12 months without complications uh, and they have elevated risk for subsequent MIs, Maybe this is not their first MI. Are they continuing to smoke? Are they a diabetic? Um, in those types of patients, I would consider uh, continuing on Ticagrelor uh, in the long term. However, if a patient was start on clopidogrel, I initially tolerated the first 12 months, did not have another event, I don't have the best data to say, well, at that point in time, am I better off switching them from clopidogrel to Ticagrelor? So it's kind of up to the clinician.